Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to take a look at a 2023 Flagstaff Classic model number 8529 RLBS. This guy weighs around 10,300 pounds or so. Three slides, a great rear living room. One of the slides upstairs is a bedroom slide, pulling that bed off the floor for you. This is gonna have the aliens showing up early. I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brennan Hanemeyer on the camera today. Say hello, Brennan. How's it going, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for stumbling upon the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. I think you should click that like and subscribe button. Thank you so much for doing that. I really appreciate it. Also, we're on Instagram, we're on TikTok, we're also on Facebook, having fun on all the platforms, sending out some unreal reels, so I think that you should check that out as well. Also, the comment section's open, so please ask us some questions, leave us some comments, let us know what you think about this awesome Flagstaff Classic. If you're looking at a floor plan like this with the hitch weights a little bit too high on that other model, I think this is gonna be the one for you. They're bringing in some sweet hitch weights. Right Above average intro, Brendan. Thanks, man. Great looking front fiberglass cap there. It's painted, looks good. Nice LED unibrow in the middle of it. And has some green. I love it. You like green, eh? Like green, yeah. That like a Dutch thing? I don't know. Green and blue, bud. Those are the colors for me. There you go. <laughs> Her turning point hitch there. Rougher style storage in through here. Battery to box location. Battery disconnect as well. We got a four point auto leveling system. It's electric. We have our 30 pumper paint tanks on either side. There's your controls for your auto leveling system. Here's our pass through storage going right through there. Nice and clean in there, Brennan. It goes in a ways to the left there too. We've got our uh, water, uh, sorry, water. Our power inverter there and our water filtration system. City water connection, black water flush kit, winterized sanitized outside shower. Uh, that's your hose for your outside shower. All that's done nice and tidy in through here. Big fan of the fact that they use metal slam lash doors, not the uh, the plastic ones. And that's a nice thick door there, Brennan. Bang. Furnace vent, gate valves down here, Goodyear tires. These are 16 inch tires, torsion suspension, fridge vent, fridge vent, kitchen window. Bonus little bit of storage here, Brandon, about a foot deep or so for some odds and ends. Secondary fresh water fill, 50 inch detachable style cord. Roof ladder, get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. Class three receiver down there. You're also prepped up on the roof there for your uh, backup camera. And then this is, this is slick down the side here, right? We got two electric awnings, LED lights in the awnings. See how there's like a weather covering on those awnings as well, Brandon, protecting that while you're going on the road. Or, Solid. You know, yeah, like in case you're like at provincial parks and the trees are hanging low, it's gonna protect your awnings, that's slick. We've also got slide toppers as an option on this guy. We have an outside gas hookup with an outside griddle that's gonna fit here. Outside table, outside speakers, outside TV. Four step entrance up and in. I love the secure steps. They're also spring assisted, so they're nice and easy to flip up and in. Six gallon gas electric water heater. And then here's the, the other side of our pass through storage. Really nice to slick in through there. There's your griddle there. Feeling good, Brendan? Feeling great. Let's go see the travel access we got on this guy. We're gonna pop this open here in a minute. As you come in, you can see you cannot get to your fridge with the slide out closed, but you can easily get to your bathroom and your bedroom um, and use that on the side of the road. Let's get this thing opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that Flagstaff 8529 RLBS. I'm trying to say those model numbers to myself more just so I can remember them. They're kind of intricate. This feels massive. Huge in here. Yeah, like this, you know, it's not a short fit feel by any means, but in comparable brands that we carry here, it just feels very, very big. The nice light woods is an option. On this one, we've got the darker uh, 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 furniture in through here. Thank you, Brendan. Um, but, and there's an arch to the roof, so it just feels big. It feels big, there's no doubt about it. Theater seats are right here. They got the manual reclining action, but they got the electric lumbar support, which I've said in previous videos, I'm a big fan of that. Just kind of give me a little extra support in the back. Uh, cup holders, spot there for the remotes. I'm facing the TV, got a great view of that, and the fireplace, sound bar, all that over there. 
Here on the door side, we've got big windows facing our campsite. The double layer uh, day night shades. I believe the day night shades are an option on this, so make sure you check your build sheet for that stuff. But uh, really, really nice here. <clears throat> Trifold style sofa. That's going to pull out to a great secondary bed with some big windows around that. USBs receptacles on this side. Both sides, buddy. Both sides. And they're inverted. So we have a uh, inverter on this one standard. Those are going to be inverted outlets. And there's a little uh, marker on there to tell you that. Right here, great storage. We got a fantastic fan here at the back, which is an option. Ceiling fan here, which is a standard. Across from the theater seats, we talked about already, but we got our nice insignia TV, bl uh, Bluetooth sound bar, fireplace putting out some good electric heat, and then cover space here across the top. Look at all the counter space underneath that TV, though. Oh, you can set up a mean taco. taco. Yeah. You're on it? Uh, yeah, that's what I was thinking. All Let's right. do it up. Right on. <laughs> um, glass stove top cover over top our three burner stove top. Nice white lights there. Oven down below. Cupboard right here. Big drawer right here. So these are coming with. The water, fil the water filter that go in the water filtration system, the TPMS system, there's your manuals. Pretty slick stuff in oh, through there. And yeah, I know. sweet spatula from Forest River, ladies and gentlemen. not a spatula, bro. Yes, it is. How is this a spatula? Well, what do you call it? I don't know. It's like a burger flipper. Spatulas yeah. you scrape oh, off the man. inside like a bowl with. Nope. Everybody, leave a comment below and let everyone and let Josh know that he's wrong. That How is, is that a spatula? It's spatula. spatula. No. It's a barbecue tool. Just wait until everyone comments. Yeah, that's a spatula. All right, four drawers <laughs> there. 18 cubic foot gas electric fridge. We've talked about this on uh, earlier videos, but we feel like, well, we know this is being discontinued, so eventually they're going to have to switch to like a 12 volt or residential option here. So run, don't walk, if this is what you want. That's it. Nice big microwave, <clears throat> covered space. I'm a big fan of this, Brendan. Look at this pantry. So it's set back a little bit to give you great spa space for garbage can or recycling bins. But look how deep that pantry is in through there. Motion sensitive light. Couple feet deep. Couple feet deep. Really solid doors. Cover space here across the top. And then cover space here, right there. Uh, hutch, receptacles and USBs. Some more soft closed drawers. Cover space there. But we haven't even talked about the island yet. Undermount stainless steel sink, pull out faucet. Covered space there. Now the shelf is useful. You don't need it for garbage can. So I'll go over there, and then I just cover spot there too. Thank you, Brian and Meyer. Reverse raised panels, eh? Love Solid wood everywhere. It feels like. Out in the slide here, we got our four seater uh, freestanding table and chairs. No carpet here down on the lower level at all. It's finished off with this woven mat, and then the linoleum on the kitchen slide. I love that door side windows. I know we said it already, but facing our campsite. And then we have a leaf on here just to make it a little bit longer if you're gonna bring any extra people. Excellent, brother. We got our nice grab handle right there to get up and in. Porcelain toilet, dump truck fits, no doubt about it. We got a cupboard there. The backside of our pantry is in through here. Undermount stainless steel sink. Switch for the inverter. Medicine cabinet. And then the shelves right here for vitamins, Brennan's. Vitamin C, perhaps. Vitamin D, Red. We get that here in the sales lot. Lots of overhead height. Skylight, nice shower head. Fantastic fan. You can't quite see it, but there is a seat here. You can sit down and shave your legs. Pocket style door into that bathroom. Man door into the bedroom. Queen size bed. And this bedroom is so big, it feels like this looks small, doesn't it? It does. I'm very impressed with this. Yeah, lots of height. Again, I'm six feet tall. I fit in this front bedroom quite easily. I don't even have an issue at all. When it drops. Yeah, yeah, just until I step up on this only piece of carpet we got in the unit. Um, back to the bed though, Brandon. Receptacles and USBs on both sides. Great looking headboard. Windows on both sides too. And I love their closets we got going on here. Look at that. <clears throat> Two drawers here. We're sticking with soft clothes even in the bedroom. That's slick. And this is back lit, which is awesome. Oh, this right here. Yeah. yeah. Great point, Brennan. Shelf, shelf. There is a hanging bar here so you hang clothes up. There's also shelves in the back here. For all the shoes. All the shoes. You can uh, put a washer dryer there side by side if you want to. There's your hookups for that. Nice details in the mirror, eh, Brendan? Very nice. Three drawers here, across from the bed. We're sticking with soft clothes. Love to see it. And check out the two big windows beside the bed, too. Or beside the dresser. Big fan of it. Big fan. 
I'm a big fan of a lot of things, Brennan. Especially these sure. trailers. All right, man. That's <laughs> the video. Hit the like button, subscribe button. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. Leave us a comment down below, and then have yourself a good day.